into a completely different direction than we are now, bring us probably closer together, but I might be wrong about that. Well, but... let's put it this way. You know, the sun could go supernovae and wipe everything out, so we do have to spread, right, spread right. out. And, and, and our resources are limited here. Our I mean, resources we... are too limited. There's not enough, there's not enough uh, resource here uh, uh, no, for, no, for the no population. Only that. No we, only we, that. We, can't, we cannot sustain a 9 billion population in 2050. If... Even if we had the Haish modal... 0. Oh yeah, device. we'll get into that. We'll get Even into if that. we had that, it's still going to, we're going to burn up the planet. So we have to get to other planets, parallel universes, whatever. And uh, by the way, you know, it's interesting that Hawking has now jumped on the bandwagon that uh, I've been talking about for decades and, you know, goes back to Tim Leary's smile, smile. Space, space vibration, vibration intelligence, intelligence increase, in, in, life increase extension. and life extension. Yeah. So we've been, you know, we've been on that bandwagon since the 70s. Yeah, all right, yeah. all right. Um, let's see, what was I? Oh, well, okay. So, uh, Jack is looking for a physics miracle. Jack and company. Yes. And the, Stargates. The physics, Stargates time travel. Lo looking for Zero a, point energy, a, yes. a, a physical escape. Physical escape, yes. From this. And, and like I say, Ron is playing both sides of this street. Yeah. And... And so he also has stringing me along, you know, talking about the metaphysical. Yeah. Now, the point I made last yeah. night at Sodini's, well, the Italian restaurant, North Beach, was that um, the uh, spiritual dimensions that you are interested in are only suitable for a very small, elite a fraction of the population. Most people are just, you know, are not able to even fathom it. The closest they could get, maybe, you know, people into the Catholic religion, the various religions, but most, well, maybe some of the Eastern religions, but that's only, uh, even that, how many people? Uh, oh, uh, oh, wait mean, a minute, wait a minute. Wait a half minute. the people most are of secular. The, most of the Christians and a lot of the Islams are in, into the eschaton. That's to the Mahdi. Oh, that's tie in with, with uh, Madinijan yeah, and Tehran right, and the, right. the trophy Iman, but... Uh, well, Which is about you know Judgment Day and, and the Rapture. Yeah, but the problem and with the problem with the the uh, the Muslims is that they are so fractured. You know, the Shia against the Sunni, and the, they kill each other, they bomb each other. And they're so it's, well, know, see, yeah, so that's you know, why you, I'm you, coming. You, that's why you, I'm you, coming you, to Jack because right. because you have you do have the scientists, kind of you know when are, you crowd are, people. Are, that, are, when you I mean not people when you crowd animals and particularly rodents yeah. together in cages they commit right. fratricide so right and that's what's happening that's what we're seeing I mean well it would yeah. be, that would be really a yeah. shame because everybody loses in that case I mean well, there, nobody wins in a nuclear war exactly but it looks as though that's the most likely scenario I, I would say that I'm not optimistic about uh, uh, the current population surviving without a cataclysmic right and, and, and if they and, 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 and that Ron as I you know and Ron well, I has said Ron, that right. they're Privately, that there's this good chance, like a ninety percent dieback. Yeah, ninety percent dieback which, is, is yeah, like we we don't you know nobody really wants to see that. Yeah, but I don't see a way out of that, especially since uh, we well, see what's happening even now in politics. How uh, our Congress is incapable of doing anything. We can't mm -hmm, even get a health care bill mm -hmm. through. Uh, you know, I mean, this everybody's just. You know, President Obama is kind of turning out to be uh, what appears to be a weak leader, like uh, Jimmy Carter, uh, and it's uh, also like Hamlet. He can't decide. He can't even decide about what to do about. Unless that. maybe he's been briefed. See, I think maybe he's. Well, been well I'm just talking about the thing with that. Uh, you know, with the uh, the 9/11. What if mastermind. there was wait, wait, what wait if there... try him? Whether he should be military court or a civil court, they can't even decide that. I mean, that's not all right. Do you think? All do you right. think the development, the, the the sudden and dramatic development of a, of a new seemingly inexhaustible, non-polluting form of energy, uh, energy production. I mean, the Haish, the yeah, Haish, the, uh, As in the zero-point energy generator that Haish and, and Modell patented. Do you think that would change the situation? or Temporarily, or? it would give hope, but until it's still, it might even make it worse. It might even make it worse because because if, if free energy, as I was saying, because of thermodynamic reasons, we'd just be heating up the atmosphere too much. If everybody, if all the billions of people had equal amounts of energy as we do here in America or in Europe or in Japan mm -hmm. or in the wealthy countries, sure. it would be uh, uh, the, the we, we be definitely heat, global. You know, heat death. 
It heat death. death. <laughs> heat death. Because you radiate heat, whether or not it's it's uh, carbon monoxide, there's still a lot of heat. So the eschaton produced. may be more than just a, uh, have more than just a spiritual dimension to it. It may be just a simple nature's way of dealing with with uh, a population that has grown too large and 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 consumes too well, much. Great. Meaning yeah. the human population. Population. Well, population human population. We're the only problem. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute now. Dynamics. Uh, population dynamics. Yeah. I mean, that's what I used to think. I I was big in playing Parrot. I was, you know, that was my big thing. Um, well, you were right. I was you were right the first school. time. <laughs> well, right the first but time. see, then I realized that, you know, deciding about having children is, is a is a very basic, a basic human. The advanced society, the birth rate. Look, you know, but, wait, 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 the advanced wait, society, wait. The, the the population rate's going down. Japan, it's going down. Right, Wherever there's right. high, yeah. you know, and it's only in the primitive societies. Uh, but if right. if you go back, you, you do. There is the thing where God said, you know, be fertile and be fruitful and multiply. Be fertile and. Multiply. Yeah, but that was then. That was in a virgin right, earth. Right, that was yeah, a very right. slow so at I the said, beginning. You know, people took that really seriously. Yeah, uh, they still know. do. <laughs> and they, they and but so if you want to if you want to counter that, you're, you're going to have to appeal to whoever you know, was the one who. who you can't counter it. it. You know, it's like so, turning back. It's like an aircraft carrier. You can't just turn it around on a hairpin curve. There's too much inertia. There's too much. There are too many poor people. Yeah, uh, the, the problems yeah. are too big. But wait, uh, are you saying there is but, there has to be a dieback? That sounds I, like what you're saying. Yes, I would say that not that uh, I like it. Well, I would say that 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 a mass holocaust in which the ninety percent die off is the most likely scenario. So Ron right, Ron from, P, Ron P was saying this as well. Of course, I mean it's all obvious. Right, all right, but that's not. And you certainly, you certainly privy to oh. more inside information than we are. Well, it's if you just look at what's going on and the inability yeah. of even the American yeah. government for the past to actually accomplish anything real, yeah. and any government, not just the American government, but you know, just all the governments are kind of paralyzed because the problems are look like they're too complex, almost insurmountable. Insurmountable. But, but see, okay, it's not any, it's not anybody's evil. People want want a happy. Uh, solution but it doesn't look very likely in my estimation looking right. at it objectively as a scientist right. that it, that's going to happen unless unless there's divine intervention well yes okay All right. barring so, divine intervention barring, divine <laughs> barring the eschaton barring a miracle barring the eschaton <laughs> most people watching this show right now and their children will not be around maybe in 10 20 years for uh, for bad reasons not for good reasons yeah. and unfortunately yeah. i hate to be uh, yeah. jeremiah but that's uh, what it looks like to me, being right. perfectly right. honest. But then, yeah, you know, along came Chicken Little. Hopefully, and not. and, and uh, saying maybe there's there's a, a way to get out of this out of this. Uh, you know, Dan, I was in. That we're in. Dan's Dan's solution those... is the only solution that I see likely, and I hope I'm very. You wrong mean about extraterrestrial this. intervention? Yeah, like some kind of extra. Divine, yeah, yeah. Dem- or ultra, something extra, whatever ultra terrestrial, extra yeah. whatever. You know, higher intelligence Divine, coming yeah. in coming because in. it's yeah. becoming very clear, in spite of what a lot of progressives and optimists say. Uh, it's become very clear that we are not able to solve. Well, might that not be in- interpreted by some more fundamental uh, religious types as as a divine or or a divine intervention or a second coming? No. Yeah, yes. 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 Yeah. yeah. So, All right. Now I'll, I'll use that as a segue into what I was yeah. saying before. That suppose you were the powers that be. Yes. And you saw this crisis coming. Yes. And you even saw the possibility of divine intervention. Yes. Possibly. Yes, yes. You would say, look, you know, they like to meddle in things. Yes. They don't, they don't want to just sit on the sidelines. Yes. And maybe they were invited to meddle. And, and at some point there was a negotiation that said, okay, look, there's going to have to be this intervention. And, and, and you know, as I say, there, there was this, uh, what do you call it, the, the um, insiders. Yes. The, the insiders who were having contact with the visitors, okay, and they did a deal. Well, that's they the most hopeful deal. scenario we have. Yeah. Barring yeah. that, yeah. see, I, I, my position, I don't know, either way. Barring something like what Dan is saying being the case, it doesn't look good, folks. I'm sorry. 
right. <laughs> you better hope Dan is right, and you better yeah, hope well, I'm wrong. And I want to be wrong in this. I don't like saying that. It's like, like that cartoon. It's like the yeah. cartoon where it it says there there's this thing. It says in case of emergency, yeah. break glass. Exactly. Okay. And Good. and behind the glass is the Bible. Oh, the Quran or whatever. Or 